Hey, what's going on guys? I'm back once again. It's been three months since I did my last video and I am really sorry, but you know what guys? We're here for a whole new start on YouTube just before the end of 2021. I thought I want to get on to uh, something a bit more different in content. I've moved past a bit of gaming content and I want to kind of do a bit of a theme from now on here on my channel. So what I'm going to do here on people, for those of you guys who are familiar with my channel, I do a couple of unboxing uh, vids before in the past, but from here on out, we're going to be doing a lot more unboxing, um, a lot of mystery box that we're going to be looking into, and then also I will continue on with some cool little Funko Pops unboxings, etc. There's quite a few things that uh, we're going to go around to. So if you're like me, you're into your movies, your gaming, your TV series, and you're happy to, you know, you, you love watching mystery boxes being unfolded, then this is probably going to be the channel for, me, for you for the next year on forward. Yeah, and that's it, guys. You know, three months in, I've got a new setup, as you can see, new background. I've once again managed to fix my Blue Yeti as well, and this is a whole new uh, stand for me. But what I have decided to do is kind of do a bit of a flashback. So you might have seen me done a, a few Colt Merc unboxing before, and by far, I feel like, so now I've opened up a few mystery boxes, these guys seem to be top tier, so I'll give the website over here, you'll see on screen, you probably see it at the side of me right now, and basically, Colt Merc, uh, they do like um, single boxes with based around the theme of either TV series, gaming, movies, etc. I mean, I purchased this in particular one on Black Friday, so I've gone for the PlayStation on um, Mystery Box, I know I've got Xbox over there, and, and I'm a big Xbox fan, but you know, Guys, forgive me for that, but, you know, PlayStation, it's just as good, you know, they've got great games as well, so, right now, the box that I've gone for is £25, and it says it's got £65 worth of value, so I'm expecting big things over here, Colt Merc, I hope you guys don't disappoint me, but the, the box has arrived, and by God, it's huge, let me just show you, I don't even think the screen could fit this in, look at that, I've just knocked my camera off a bit, how mental is that? That is absolutely huge. Uh, so, you know what, guys? I have already opened the top part because I don't want to deal with the hassle of, you know, unboxing it right over here and just spoiling the video. But, Colt Merc, I hope this is great. And if you guys are happen to be watching, please, for my sake, do an Xbox mystery box. I will purchase that straight away. But for now, let's check out what the contents we got. Oh, before I get started as well, guys, uh, rather than me doing up and downs that I've done before in the mystery boxes, I'm here on now going to give each item out of five stars. So one meaning it's meh, it's crap, it needs going in the bin. Five means I love it. And at the end, I'll give a box overall uh, out of five stars as well. So for example, if one item I feel like is five stars, but absolutely incredible, and the rest of them are still like three, two stars, I might still give the box overall five stars if I feel like I got my money's worth and I absolutely am um, chuffed with the item. So there we go. Um, hopefully that's covered it off. And yeah, let's go ahead. Let's uh, see what Colt Merc has delivered for me. Like I said, guys, Colt Merc, you set it up big expectation. I love the v2 box i got star wars i was like mm. i now go back when i say it was a good box but this uh playstation box i got quite a few people that i know are into playstation so probably they'll be happy watching this video right now first item i've got let's get it on screen okay that's interesting um need to turn it around guys it's a 3d poster print of a, oh wow Wow, so that's free. It's probably hard to tell on the on mobile over here that I'm recording with um, that you know you can see the 3D pattern. But wow, I'd, I'd, I'd obviously I'll do the values at the end and see how much this is worth. But I'd be happy to easily pay a tenner for this easily. That is incredible. Ah. Uh, I'm gonna give it four stars, guys. I I think this is a good start. Of course, Merc, four stars for this. This is this is perfect. This is a perfect gift as well. To be honest, we'll put this aside, especially with uh, Christmas coming up. You know, these things are all gonna come in use. Let's go ahead. I have to really dig in over here, guys. This box is freaking huge. Honestly, it's about a, a meter easily plus box size. Um, we got a notepad, obviously we can expect one of these um, when it comes to a mystery box. PlayStation themed notepad since 1994, I, li I like the colour of it. 
Oh wow, the design's quite nice as well. Check that out. Got all the cool little the X triangle square boxes over there. Notepads aren't useful now and then. Um, obviously, you could do with notepads. Um, I'll give this a free star because, to be honest, at the end of the day, notepads are handy to have at home. I do have quite a bit of them, but I think this one I'll keep aside, especially now for to do with uh, YouTube, and I might um, write, jot some notes down for me around forward. Boom, put that aside. Um, Got to tuck in really... Oh, my. I don't even think I can reach... You see me off camera right now, but I genuinely do not think I can reach with how large this box is. Might have to topple everything over. Uh, here we go. I've got a square box. Okay, so it's an unboxing. We didn't unbox. Let's check this out. I see it. It's a, it's a mug, guys. It's a PlayStation mug. There we go. Woo. Um quite a basic design I'm not gonna lie um, I would have I would have liked to seen it maybe in black and then obviously go with the color themes of the actual controllers that would have stood out a lot more I feel like PlayStation you uh, missed a good opportunity to make a good mug there because it's a plain mug I'm only gonna give it two stars because I feel like the creativity wise it's just, what it's a simple black and white mug at the end of the day like I can't give it any more higher than that put that aside over here in um in this unboxing as well with the PlayStation it didn't particularly say on Cold Merc what it actually come with. Like usually they say there's a door mat involved or a 3D poster, but on this one there was nothing. Oh right, a traveler mug. Amazing. Right. <laughs> a metal travel mug. Now uh we wanted one of these, so I think that's that sorted. Or rather, I say we wanted. My missus wanted a travel mug, so uh, I think you know. I don't. I don't think she had PlayStation in mind for travel mug, but at the end of the day, it uh, it, it does the job. Uh, it looks quite sturdy. Right. Oh wow. Okay. Definitely good to keep your coffee warm, especially in this weather where it's been heavily snowing up over here. Um, hopefully, the weather clears up soon. But I think a lot of people are looking forward to having a white Christmas. I'm going to give this a three stars because, in fact, I'm going to give it four stars. Sorry, guys. It is a good it is a good thing to have on over here. It's quite useful um, at the end of the day. And I like it. it's a perfect season for it as well. So, Colt Merck, thank you for that. I'm happy with that as well. That gets one thing out of our shopping list. And now, finally, I feel like there's a might be a few more items here. Okay, this is quite large. This is probably why the box was so... Whoa. What is this? Um, well, it's definitely heavily bubble wrap, so let's move this all this out of the way first. I have no idea what this is. Right, let's uh, get it out of its bubble wrap over here. Okay, so it's, it, I guess this is something that you just hang on uh, as a decoration. Um, I, I, don't, I don't even know what much else what you could do with that. Someone will probably have to explain to me in the comment section. But in terms of the print wise, I, I don't know if you can see it clearly over here on the camera, but it's kind of like smudged around the edges. I feel like the detailing isn't that great, but if this was an Xbox version of this, I would have given it a five stars because I would have definitely <laughs> done something with this. But again, the come with the plain black and white combo. Again, it's a missed opportunity, but this is a four star item, I think, because I think a lot of people, especially huge gamers, would love to put this around somewhere in their gaming room. That's a, that is amazing. I never thought. That. I don't know, I've never seen anything like this on mystery boxes before, so for something unique, that is incredible. Well, we'll put this aside, guys, because uh, that's definitely why the box was so freaking large in the first place. Um, now, have I got anything else? I'm going to have to topple this box. 
I think that's no. I think that's it. Oh, something's fallen out. I've I've, I've seen them. I believe they're pin badges. Here we go. Let me just tuck in. Right. So yeah. Um, cool. We've got a key ring. Firstly, key ring. Cool key ring. With that three stars because that's a that's a cool key chain over there. And then finally, some pin badges. I, 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 they're bonuses at the end of the day, but I, I'm really not going to do much with these pin badges, let's be honest. So, sorry, Colt Merc, but I'm going to give it one star. I, it's a, Again, it, it, the other items I feel like made up the value. I'm not going to bother calculating them at the end because they're just freebies in my eyes. So, that's that done. Um, overall, so far, uh, what do I think I'm going to give this box overall? Come on, I'm gonna give you four out of five stars for this box. To be honest, so it, it, I'm, I'm not gonna lie that that in particular wall art is quite impressive. The 3D, the 3D uh, poster as well that I have over there, that is really good. And these are perfect gifts uh, as well. Travel mug again, useful. I got a PlayStation mug. At the end of the day, you know, you can always do with a mug. That's the truth. So yeah, a four out of five stars. Great overall content, but. Let's go ahead and do a price total overall and then I'll get back and, you know, sum it up what we're going to do next time. Right guys, so I've done my in-depth research, I have to say in-depth research on the internet because some of these items were quite difficult to find. So, firstly we'll get the big boy out of the way, the um, PlayStation wooden sign. I had to spend ages trying to just find out like what the hell this is and... I ended up typing in wooden sign and luckily enough it actually it immediately called that. Uh, this one's actually £17 on the internet and there is a blue version of this which I thought was quite cool. Blue with white buttons uh, but there's quite a few designs such as these that's coming out from Pyramid and I'm tempted to get one. If anything this is a uh, um, you know a mugs kind of like pointing me towards the right direction of what I can do next for my in particular home. Um, like I said, quite cool, and I love it as well. I think a lot of people will be interested in seeing that. Um, the 3D wall art, now that, the name of that is called uh, PlayStation Shapes 3D Poster. That's like the correct name, and I can't uh, give that a, a full accurate price. Now, the reason why, so again, that's from Pyramid Group, and there's two stores that says uh, you pre-order now, but don't have a price for it. So I don't even think it's been released, and if that's the case... Colt Merc has just sent me an, a, like an exclusive early on and uh, I can't, I, I mean like I said, I'm impressed with it straight away when I got it, I was really really happy but I'm only going to say this from like picture memory because I've gone to like popular retail stores and been looking at some 3D wall posters myself um, to do with like gaming so it's like looking at some Halo ones and they were coming around 10 to 12 pounds so i'm gonna say 10 pounds but i might be underestimating that value if anyone could find out the true value after this video please comment that um like i said it'll be great to get that information uh the travel mug uh, that's coming up at 10 pound as well nice little tenner over there uh the notepad that was straightforward enough i found out on amazon straight away it's just slightly under a fiver um so i'm just gonna round that up to five pounds and then finally the PlayStation mug came at £6, although I want to say there's quite a few cool PlayStation mugs for like £7, £8, like one with the PlayStation controller as an actual handle, and I would love to have had that, I would have even used it, but for a plain design mug, mm, I feel like 6 quid's way too much for it to be fair, um, but overall, the value of the box is totaled up as £48 now, just slightly under the 65 that I expected. I mean, like I said, the keychains and the badge or the pin badge, you can add that up to whatever you feel like. But again, I don't think it will uh, cover the full 65 quid that was active, uh, advertised. But I feel like I got my money's worth. And Colt Burke, I have to say, I'm really, really impressed with the box. So I'm still going to give it four out of five stars. Um, like I said, there is a couple of things that I, loved, I think could have just made that box, just that push it to that five stars bit. I'm definitely going to be ordering from Colt Merc again. And honestly, guys, I do recommend checking out their website. They've got some great mystery boxes. I'm really tempted with the Witcher one. Um, obviously, Witcher Season 2 is coming out, so I might get that. I uh, did a massive uh, uh, V2 box last time, and the V3 box is very, very tempting me at the moment as well. So I might see uh, you might see that on my channel very soon. Uh, but also, uh, please, Colt Merc, if you're watching this, 
if somehow by a miracle you you guys have stumbled onto my video, please release an Xbox One. Please, I beg you, because I will do that straight away. As soon as that's on store, I will buy it, and I'll love to un un unbox that mystery box as well. Anyway, guys, uh, that's obviously uh, wrapping up the cult merch side of things. Um, I could just say I want to uh, quickly just discuss uh, something that you might see uh, about my channel for the next foreseeable future. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. It's the first one that I've obviously come back after three months. And uh, I'm kind of going to be doing this uh, uh, a bit more now. So you, if you know my channel previously, I've done like Funko Pops unboxing as well and reviews. Still going to do that. I'm also going to be unboxing other like cool tech. So you might see like this X Xbox logo, this, uh, it's that's the Grogu, that's his correct name, yeah, the baby Yoda over there, um, you can see like some cool little gadgets and that's some things I'm going to want to work on as well, unboxing some cool little tech, some geeky items, some stuff that you can see, get as gifts and in fact if you want a quick review of these items that I end up unboxing, I've got an Instagram account for that called at DJ Wacky Review. So there's there it is it'll pop up over there as you can see. Uh, check that out that Instagram as well. I am going to be doing a competition as well that I'm going to announce on my next video. If I get up to 1,250 subscribers, one of you guys are going to win a lucky prize. And in order, I will, I'm going to plan out the details for that competition as well. Be quite simple enough to enter. But yeah. There's got to be a lot of good content coming my channel in the foreseeable future, guys. Uh, so hopefully you're over here hitting that subscribe button, coming on board, and obviously appreciating these contents that I do create for you. If you can uh, do me a small favor, hit that like button. And don't forget to do that. It helps a small-time YouTuber like myself. Really, really do appreciate it as well for all the support and the love that I do get. And yeah, guys, that's me uh, just pretty much saying I'm back. And uh <laughs> I guess we'll see what happens next time when I do these mystery boxes. But for now, for now, guys, yeah. Hopefully, you guys have a fantastic Christmas coming up. We're end, we're at the end of November, so hopefully December brings that miracle month. Uh, and hopefully, this weather clears up as well. Um, hopefully, but at the end of the day, I think some people would like to have a white Christmas this time round. Either way, guys, it has been your guy DJ Wacky. I will see you all next time. Peace up. Loot Crate exclusive Alien. Oh, right, it's a face hugger. Quite a happy face hugger, really. Like, um...